Welcome back to the channel everybody and let's just get into it. I'm in the middle of a toy hunt. I went to two different Rosses, so these videos are kind of mix and match. Uh, I couldn't really remember which store I was filming at and so you might get the two stores mixed up. But anyways, they had some stuff popping up. Check that out. That is Monster Jam. That box was huge. I don't have cars and stuff like that, but I just thought I'd take a look around. And this store has those big, gigantic shelves against the back wall. And let's just take a look. I immediately see G.I. Joe, Zamet, or Tomax up there. They got plenty of those guys. Um, nothing really new. Oh my gosh, look at that. AEWs. Totally new. I set them all up so you can pretty much see it's what, Series 10. And I think it's almost the whole wave. Check it out. I was looking at these for $3.99. That is a fantastic deal. Anyways, um, here's some more of that shelving. And you can see they got the Toonie Terrors and stuff in there. There's those Zamets again. Um, and just a whole lot of like, just stuff that I'm not, those, those statues, just stuff that I'm not really gonna pick up. That Zamet, man, he's just hanging out. Nobody's even grabbing that for five bucks. Um, one day I might just come in with like $30 and grab them all. There's a Lola up there. There's, um, you know, some Barbie stuff. Uh, not a whole lot that like piques my interest in this area. So anyways, here's a different target. They had a Power Rangers there. They had some play sets and stuff up in the top. Let's just go down the shelves. I kind of want to just peek behind this stuff without having to move everything. Dinosaurs. There's like you can dig up a fossil. That was kind of cool. What is that? Like five bucks or something like that, I think. Let me check. Yep. $4.99. That's a pretty decent price to give your kids so you can play with it. Um, not a whole lot else. Down on this shelf, you got the Dragon Ball Zs. You got more Tomaxes. And check that out. Some Gundams in there. Got some different stuff. Uh, the aisle started getting crowded here uh, on my way back and so like uh, you may see some disruption in the video and stuff like that but that's just a um, matter of people coming in the aisle so anyways um got those like nerf guns and stuff like that so good thing patrick's taking over nerf maybe he can keep the nerf out of these discount stores and get them sold there you go i had to step out of the way anyways uh finishing off that shelf then right across we got pegs we got a lot of those power ranger swords Look at that, Peppa Pig. And then you got some Transformers in there. You got a Dungeons and Dragons. You got some of those same Marvel Legends still hanging out. Uh, some Toonie Terrors back there. It's the same one. It's got the Firestar has been hanging out. Check that out. A whole bunch of them. Got a couple of those Mandalorian figures. Um, that Dungeons and Dragons down there. Again, and then Barbecue was in this store. Uh, he's kind of been here for about three weeks now i think and um i already got a couple or i'd grab them you know it's just too many but anyways i uh, got some more legends and stuff down there and then coming up i was coming up to the shelf here i had to move out of the way again dungeons and dragons my hero academia i got some of that stuff and wait for it there's a surprise on the end which is pretty cool and uh, right at the end look at that Oh my gosh, is that Britt Baker? One of 5,000. That's right. That was a chase. Yep, the box wasn't in perfect condition, but I thought for like four bucks, I should grab it. So that was the one of 5,000 Britt Baker. There's the AEW Dynamite. Here I am walking up to the register to pay for it. And that's how I ended my toy hunt. Anyways, everybody, I really appreciate you tuning in and have a fantastic day.